Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to discuss the following question and the question says that a fair coin is tossed 600 times. Which of these results is most likely? A. Heads 102, tails 498, B. Heads 425, tails 175, C. Heads 326, tails 274. We know that in a uniform model, all outcomes are equally likely Also we know that experimental probability is equal to frequency of actual outcome upon total number of trials With this key idea, let us proceed to the solution. Now in this question, we are given that a fair coin is tossed 600 times and we need to find which of these results is most likely. Now in the question, we are given a fair coin that means both head and tail have equal chances to come So we can say the outcomes are equally likely and thus we expect probability of head as 1 upon 2 which is also equal to the probability of tail as we know the outcomes are equally likely which can also be written as probability of head is equal to probability of tail is equal to 1 by 2 which can also be written as 0 0.50 it is given that the coin is tossed 600 times so we calculate experimental probability of heads and tails in all the three parts that is A, B and C and from the key idea we know that experimental probability is equal to frequency of actual outcome upon total number of trials and the first part is heads 102 and tails 498 in part A Experimental probability of head is given by 102 that is frequency of actual outcome upon total number of trials which is given as 600 so we get 0 0.17 also experimental probability of tail will be equal to frequency of actual outcome which is given as 498 upon total number of trials that is 600 so we get the probability as 0 0.83 so experimental probability of head is equal to 0 0.17 and of tail 
is equal to 0 0.83. Now we shall find the experimental probability for heads 425, tails 175. Now experimental probability of head will be equal to frequency of actual outcome which is given as 425 by total number of trials that is 600. So we get the experimental probability of head as 0 0.708 and similarly experimental probability of tail will be equal to 175 by 600 that is 0 0.2 291. Now in part C we have heads 326 and tails 274. Now we are going to find the experimental probability of head and tail for part C. So experimental probability of head will be equal to frequency of actual outcome which is given as 326 by total number of trials that is 600. So we get the experimental probability of head as 0 0.543 and similarly experimental probability of tail will be equal to 274 by 600 which is equal to 0 0.456 now, in all the three cases, in part C, we see that the experimental probabilities are close to theoretical probabilities, which is equal to 0 0.50. So, we say part C is most likely Which is the required answer? This completes our session. Hope you enjoyed this session.